All right, got the adapter in. Uh, <clears throat> um, these are PCI Express in the EME M.2 and a PCI Express adapter to the Express card. I want to see if it works in my laptop and with the Clover software. Uh, I already cleaned my windows on it, but I don't know if it was boot or not. If not, I'll just freshly install it. All right, and uh, we'll see how that goes. Uh, package from AliExpress from China, $20. All righty. Check out the bag right quick here. Right All right, it was tricky, but I got it in there. And so it looks before I put the lid on. Camera 12 X4 PCI Express X4 Western Digital. You can see the writing on it. All right, see how it goes. So I got my laptop down here. I will disable the side of drive inside and see if it works. Here this clips down. All right, move back later. All right, took all my drives out. The only thing is in there is the uh, now. Oh, it gets a little blue flusher light. So, yep, it's indicating. Sticks out a little bit. All right, I will come back and tell you how it went. See if it'll boot up. Just yeah, off the little uh, clover, made a little root, root joint there. Uh, I had to do a fresh install of windows. This is the 24H2 one. I'm kind of cus customizing to make this work. Check off Internet Explorer and, and uh, Windows Defender. Put my own stuff on there. It's making it pretty slick. Device Manager so far. I put this in Disable for the SD card. That way it don't show up on the thing so I don't accidentally erase it. Uh, 11 processes 
3.7 of a memory being used, uh, 31.9. I'm doing some updates, that's why it's so high. But yeah. It's working really nice. Uh, I'll have to test it a little bit later for the score. It's probably not that big, uh, since it's probably a uh, smaller generation Pizza Express, but it still works. And I can just use my uh, SATA drive as a storage device. All right, I'll uh, see y'all later. Oh yeah, let's forget, I'm cutting the little piece here. I can slide it back in that way and just cover up the hole that way no one can access it. I had a score of the M and D drive. <sighs> it's the same score as the SATA drive, but you can't be you can't fault this thing because it wasn't made for in the ME drives. But it scores in that other list. Now I can just use my SATA for my storage device. Well, until next time. Bye.